had just 185 yards against Carolina. They put a Special. Nobody in the, I would say, ever in the history of football is as good at a passes defense. He's got like 68 or 70 or something in his career, which is nuts for a D lineman. Jumps up and hits it. Interception. Monster, monster play for this team. He knocked down four passes, which was a personal best against New England four days ago. And now he just leaps into the air and pulls it down and has a touchdown on Thanksgiving. As Tracy said, what did he tell us last night? He called his performance here in that overtime win on Thanksgiving Day 2012 at Detroit. One of the proudest and fondest moments and memories of my career. Mm. He's got a shot at number two right here. Yeah. He's already off the same story. game. Offense. Five-yard penalty. We played the try. Yeah, he had in that game eight years ago. Five quarterback hits, three tackles for a loss, and two pass deflections. It's a day he's got a touchdown. It's really unbelievable. I mean, the system. They used to rush five guys to get one-on-one -on -one all the time. Now he gets double teamed more often in the passing situations. Extra point. Fair pairing. No good. By the way, it was just the third pick of the year. That's it. Just the third all year of the Texas. Who else? JJ puts the Texans on the board. Play stop Peterson gives them a chance to go on the next play. But now watch this next one. He's in a he's outside the tight end and base first out. Doesn't normally play there. He shuts the run down, so they don't want to run that way. So they try and throw the ball over the top. Nope, shuts that down too. Did you believe the Texans did not even have a single takeaway in first half action through the first ten games of the season? I mean, not one. Then they 